So this is the community dog house. I, I, I built a lot of houses. I have to say this up first. Is that? I, I, I... It's like magic. Cool this is the coolest room in the house by far. I mean, come on now. Yeah. Yeah, this is. This is the okay. okay guys, this is the long anticipated video. We're going to be doing a full tour of Flair and Andrew and Macy's house. I, like you guys, have not seen it since they've moved in and all the furniture have come and gone, but they're telling me it's pretty much all decorated, ready to go. So we're going to do a full tour and take you through all the stuff that we have done and show you the cool features that we have put in Andrew and Macy's house. So let's get inside and see what this house is looking like now that they've all moved in. All right, guys, as you can see, we still have gravel down out front. We're still doing a little bit of site work. They're putting the pool in the backyard. So the inside's done, we got him all moved in. Now we're starting to work on the outside. Those videos will continue to come, but let's take a look inside as we walk down this gravel driveway, which will soon to be concrete. We did put a little grass out here because their dog needs a place to go. And that hopefully has kept the mud out of the house. Well, well, well. Andrew. Look who it is. You, your, your friendly neighborhood builder. <laughs> there it is. And soon to be neighbor. Yeah. Yeah, all right. So we're excited. I have not seen the inside of your house since you moved in. Yeah. It looks a little different now. Yeah. 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 That's the part. See, as a home builder, I never get to see this stuff until there's a, a God forbidden problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm excited to see. We want the viewers to give us a full tour. Full tour. Are you ready for okay. us? I'm ready. Yeah, come okay. on in. Yeah. All right. You're in. Here's the part that looks fantastic. Yeah. The beam situation. Remember, we I misordered a beam. Oh, there. I remember, yeah. You remember that? No, yeah, I do. But it doesn't matter because it looks good now. Oh, so there That's are, all there that are some memories of the aches and pains of building. I guess the first question is, would you do it again? Would I build again? Yeah. Not for a long time. Yeah. Nothing against you. It's just a lot. Like, I would have to be in, like, a really not busy part of my life. Like I'd have to be bored no, I know. and then make, let's go do it. I enjoyed the process, but not enough to want to do it again anytime soon, yeah. if that makes sense. Right. Kind of, I wouldn't say it's like a one and done thing, but it'd be like maybe in 20 years. Okay, if it's not, you wouldn't do it again because Brad the Builder was a pain in the butt. Yeah, exactly, no, 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 that wasn't it. I'm gonna no. put words in your mouth. No, that wasn't okay. it. It just, too, too many decisions to be made all the time. And I feel like if I was gonna build another house, I need to live in this one long enough to decide what I would do different to make the next one different enough. Yeah. Cause I love everything about this house. So if you're like build another one, I'll just build another one of these. And yeah. that wouldn't make much sense yeah, obviously. Make, so I, 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 I need to wait till like the, the styles are different and the trends are different and stuff like that. The way you would like move that. again is if you didn't like your neighbor and that's me. So it could happen. No, wait, yeah. There is a chance that could happen. <laughs> yeah, could. yeah. But uh, you know, I get that a lot. People say, they're, they're glad it's done. Yeah. They really 100%. enjoyed the process, but they're glad it's over with. So, all right, let's kind of get into it. Do you have a favorite part? I mean, when people come Ooh. in, what are, are they, do we have a wow effect? You I would say the wow effect is in, in effect. Yeah. yeah, I think I think we did pretty good with this. Yeah. Everyone always comes in and says, wow, they like it, yeah. Did it, does it feel bigger, the house, than when we looked at the blueprints for oh, the yeah. time? Oh, yeah. Yeah, a lot bigger than yeah. that. Yeah. I didn't think it was going to be this big, looking at the blueprints. I know. It's, it, yeah. It's deceiving. Yeah. That's the hard part. It's to scale. I don't quite know. It's yeah. Like sometimes people make mistakes going, that room needs to be a little bit bigger. Then it gets so big. Yeah, I gotcha. get lost in it. But yeah. do you feel that we're... I feel like it's a good size. Like, I don't feel lost. I don't feel like... If I have to go from one area to the house to the other, I'm out of breath. It's not like too big. I feel like it's plenty big for us where I can feel like we can grow into it and not have to like upgrade down the road. Okay. But I don't feel like, like if I'm by myself, I don't feel like I'm in this big, like lonely house, you know? It's, it feels cozy. But can you still communicate or do you have to go, Macy? I, yeah, I do have to yell, okay. depending on which, which area I'm in, especially if I'm in the lower level. Yeah, then, I, then, I gotta, then I really gotta yell. Then you gotta text. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay. exactly. So, so where would you uh, like to give us a tour? Where would you like to start? We uh, could just start, start right we could here. start here. We could, I mean, the office okay. is right here. We can okay. we walk this in here. This is headquarters? This is, I, to, to be 100% honest, I'm hardly ever in here. Only because the man cave, which you guys are gonna see here in a bit, is so cool. Okay. And it's nice to be able to work and get away and be able to do all the YouTube stuff and keep the YouTube stuff away from, like, if this was my YouTube office, There'd be papers everywhere. There'd be product everywhere. It just looks like a bomb. You'll see. It looks so like a bomb. this is kind of like your little escape. You can yes. kind of do your own thing. I can come in here and send an work. email. And I've got the surveillance yeah, look at this. going on right now. So at any, at any moment. What do you got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cameras. Yeah. 
And they're all on here at one time. They're ready to rock and roll. So at any, at any moment, no matter where you're at on my property, I can pretty much see. So yeah, I'll sit in here and like, this is like, like I said, it's the nicer office. So if we get like paperwork for insurance, that would go here. Okay. Accounting stuff would go here. Bank statements here. Up, upstairs is a bunch of hoopla, all the YouTube stuff. So nice I don't find myself in here much, okay. but it, it is nice to keep it like clean and, and not and kind of cluttered for you. Yeah, that's right by your front door, but also you can get your you got the nice views. See who's yeah, coming down the lane. Exactly. And then this antler chandelier. Yep. Uh, we still have a couple bulbs. A couple bulbs missing. I think we got this out of the box. It was broken. It was broken from the box. Yeah, we're we're getting a new one. New they one. said. Yeah. Welcome to buying stuff. Everything. Yeah. I think we've taken light fixtures back yeah. to the wrong size, too yep. small, something broken. Oh yeah, but yeah, I, I like it. I, we'll, we'll eventually grow and we'll get some cool stuff hung up there on the shelves. Right now it's pretty that plain Jane, time. but it just it just takes time. Less than a month or yeah, so. Less, yeah, less than a month so. since we've been been in here and right. we're slowly getting it kind of put together. But, and then this, which you guys have seen, the, the yeah. living room area, which yeah. I like. So I remember the fireplace when oh, Tom yeah. was building that reclaim, we went on it, went down and selected at yeah. the reclaim wood. Yeah. And then, the big hassle, a lot of it was, is trying to get the right height, but also there's a metal uh, deflection yeah, on there. That for the heat, yeah. That we did not know about. Yeah. And when the showrooms, they don't show it. But yeah. You, you don't really notice it. And most people that come over don't don't even notice it until I point it out. And they're like, oh, I just figured that was kind of part of it. Right here. So, so that's what we it looks do. nice and clean. You wouldn't realize that this is designed to keep this from starting on fire, which is rather important, I would say. And then we have the see-through fire. Yep. You can see all the way out to the deck. Acts as another window, yeah. so I and like that. And it's been 95 degrees, so I'm sure you haven't had this. Haven't, haven't had to turn it on yet. No, <laughs> have not. And then the kitchen, I'm guessing my wife's favorite part, yeah. is over here. I like well, it we'll too, to it is Macy, nice. What her favorite part is, Macy, come on over here. <laughs> I'm so, guessing it's the kitchen. Yeah. There's some favorite parts, but is there the whole house or is there some stuff that you're... Definitely the kitchen pantry. Like, we can hide everything in the pantry. Hi. The pantry and the, the, the way it lays out. Yeah. I mean, do you feel like... Sometimes people go, well, you should have more counter, more cabinets, but with that no. big pantry. <laughs> we have a lot of empty cabinets still. <laughs> I tell people that. There are There's a good amount of empty cabinets still, yeah. Which will eventually be turned into junk drawers and yep. cabinets. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, they'll get filled eventually, yeah. but really yeah, it has been nice. To not do junk drawer. I'm like, we got to stay organized. Otherwise, it just, yeah. just piles. Because you're starting fresh. Let's see if we can keep yeah. it on keep it on the rails. Yeah. yeah. Year from now, we'll probably be having a different discussion, but <laughs> we'll do our best. But with the open plan, I mean, if you're getting furniture and there's some area rugs and stuff i'm sure time will that will yeah. help because it's, it's so big and open but uh do you feel comfortable i mean with the big yeah. house sometimes they get so big you you feel like you're you're looking for a cozy space to <laughs> yeah i i don't that's what i say i feel like we hit like the perfect in between where you can enjoy a big space without feeling like you're in a big empty cold house so yeah. It feels like we can we can fill it up. I don't, yeah. I don't, I don't All right, see the that pot filler. Issue. Have we used the pot filler? Used it this morning. Did you really? Used it this morning. Okay. You, every day. I'm never a big fan of those things because every day. Every day, well, that's what you wanted it because you're used to it. That in the event, I always say, okay, if that thing starts dripping, where's the drain? There is no. There's no. There's no drain, so don't let it drip. Yeah, don't let. But it yeah, drip. we do use it every day, which and is nice. Big hood, and we have ten foot ceilings, and it vaults up to eleven foot with all that. Uh, yeah. I think that's a. Uh, the, all the wood. All the wood ceiling. Mm -hmm. Nice. Holder, so. Yeah. All the under counter. There's no outlets on your backsplash. Yeah. Everything's underneath here. Oh yeah. Tons of drawers. And yep. Drawers. Yeah. That's it. This one's. Spice this one's really cool because it's it's for all the utensils, but it holds them vertical, so, oh, so it's, it's easy it's easy to, right to get to right here, and then your spice racks in this one. Okay. So well, you guys are organized. Look, we're at trying. Yeah. We're trying. I'll give we, that to Macy. I'm yeah, that's not me. No, I, I had nothing to do with that. And at then all. we finally got the refrigerator panels yes, on. Yes, the panels are on. That's the super size refrigerator. That's a first for you guys. You didn't have that in your last house, did it, you? Or a built-in one like this? We didn't have one with, with the panel fronts. No, okay. we had a pretty big one though. Yeah. But nothing, yeah. nothing that like well, this. Well, living so. out in the country, it's loaded. A little way from stores, so yeah. you have this refrigerator. You got one in the, in the pantry. Yeah, the butler's that's, pantry. Something you would never do without. Out the oh my God. the butler's pantry is pretty nice. Well, let's take yeah. a look yeah. at that. I call it the Costco pantry because when you come from Costco, you have three times you have to order. You know, can't get one jar of peanut butter. You have to get six, right? Yeah. yeah. So, so here's the all the glass. We, we always way. leave this pretty much open, but it is the, it is nice, especially if Brooklyn's hungry and wants to. She knows where the snacks are. Oh, she so does. occasionally, we'll, now she knows how to operate the door, so we got to figure something else out. But. I'm a girl with my own heart. You got to go where the snacks are at. Yeah. So Butler's this, pantry. This has got as many cabinets in your pantry as what most people have in their kitchen. Yeah. So you really have 
This is two kitchens. Pretty Finger much two. Man Cave is another one. Yeah. The bar downstairs. So y y there's several. Yeah. Lots of cabinets. Yeah. Here, are you getting used to the? Uh, yeah, I'm getting used to all the the new tech stuff, like this and how it opens. I'm getting used to it. Are you getting used? Yeah. It's, it's so normal. You want to go up high and put yeah. your coffee cup in. No, I like it. But when you open and close it, if you warm something up, it doesn't spill. When you no. Close it, is that true? That's what no, it doesn't. It doesn't spill. It goes okay. nice and nice and gentle. So there, so, and there's you got a, a window you got a, looking out. You got a so sink. It feel like you're in a so, dark part of the house. You have no. a secondary kitchen. Yeah, I hang out back here. And I really like Macy how you picked out the tiles and tiled this entire yeah. back wall because that's such a feature. You got you're looking out and yes. the tile. You'll know when you didn't do it right because it'll look funny. Not everything looks right. It looks nice. Yeah. What's nice is you can keep your toaster and like what you have over here, yep, the coffee, coffee maker. Yeah. So this can be the messy part. Exactly. And your kitchen being open to your living room always is nice and clean. Yep. Looks good. Yeah. We I come in here and I'll destroy this and then and shut then the door. Just close and the door. Doesn't no matter. See. No one knows. And yeah, uh, so let's great. start. Let's look. So when you come home, let's start back here. The mud room is what we call it, right? Coming in from the garage. Yep. So from the garage. So. And you did all the... the so, yeah, we can show them the garage, I guess, yeah. real quick. So the garage floor, I think once you have one of these... Yeah, you can't go back. You can't go back. No. Put, finishing the floors like this. So yeah, putting nice. the epoxy on it, the and flake. Get this. You guys, he has an air-conditioned garage. Yeah. So this AC unit right up here, it's amazing what that will do for this huge oh, space. Oh, it'll keep... I mean, even if it's probably like 95 outside, I can probably keep this thing at like 75 with just that AC unit running. And then so it feels like almost like the house pretty much in here. And you did that for the dogs. Yes. Because they, they live right in here. Yep. So when we, then, when we leave, we want to lock the dog up, then we can put her in here and keep it nice and cold. We didn't, weren't able to do floor drains because of the septic system yes, out here. Yes, yes. And that's kind of a hassle. They're, yep. they're, they're really sticklers. You have to have a whole separate septic system. Yep. And it just wasn't It wasn't worth the money, yeah. You can just hose it out so, and go outside. Luckily, everything it. pitches that way. Yeah. So we can you know, just give it a quick squeegee. And here's our elevator, our yep. lift. Yeah, Shoot. see, we show them the, show them the elevator. Yeah. Look at that sucker. Sheesh. Yeah. And that thing holds 250 pounds. Yeah, we put it, we put it to the test for the jerky too. Oh, did, did Banjo? Oh, yeah. Has he ridden it up? Ban yet? We did not let Banjo on there. No. <laughs> That's funny. I don't think it's for adults, but uh, there is a set of chains, which I don't know if they make a whole lot of sense. You could put on, or you can put some brackets. But all that does is everything has to stay inside this. Inside thing, the box. You know yeah, right. yeah, we figured that out pretty but quick. But it's just kind of a weird, wimpy little thing. So some people take them off. I see you have, but this comes all the way to the floor. Yeah. And then you load your boxes and shoot it up to the up storage there, room. And that's where you stored all, all your gear and merch. And yep. So Christmas saves, lights, all the good stuff. Saves the back, saves a that's lot right. of That's right. It's so important. So Awesome. Once people have these two, I think they'll find out yeah. they're pretty nice. To they have. are handy. Yeah. I've already used mine quite a bit. So I do, I do like it. I think that was a good investment. Well, this was a lot going on. We originally had the big one, this one here. It's a larger. And then with the roof design and everything, it yeah. couldn't fit. Yep. So then we went back to the small one. You came out here going, well, I don't want the small one. Yeah, so we got to load her up. Got to get to the big one. So then we had to do some modifications. I think it took as long to build this, I think, as your house. So this, yeah, it did take a minute. This was our last yeah. inspection. It, it did take a little bit, but it's worth it. Yeah. It was worth having the big I, the big rig here. Yeah, I'm glad you put, we pushed you pushed the envelope. We are able to trim some stuff up. Actually, what we did is we modified this cage yeah, got it. to make it fit because it was too tall. I see. And that's what was the delay, Yeah. so we fixed it. So. You really don't put boxes on. No, you don't stack them that high. Yeah. No, it looks so, good though. I like it. It looks good. I'm, I'm glad you like it. And then another cool thing. So I think this is a, a, the bomb. This is a good, another good investment. I've used it about every, at least once a week. For, well, you're out here in the dirt and the mud. Yeah. And so Lucy's running around. She loves the mud. She loves swimming. She loves anything in the, in the dirt. So, so for this dog wash, you've got a couple of different hoses. You got one yep. here, here, and then this is something I, you might need to invest in something like this. That's an electric power washer. That's it, yeah. Not for the dogs. No. Just clear that out. We're not power oh, washing dogs. No, oh, no but kids, no, 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 it's for the, the garage floors to make it easy. So you get dirt, especially in the winter in here. And so it's hooked up to this, which has hot water. So you can do a hot power wash in the winter if you want it to be. And it's got a 150 foot retractable hose nice. and you can just power wash your garage out without having the, the different fittings. Yeah. You don't have to have a gas power washer and no hose. Like it's just all in one and it just retracts. That is awesome. I saw it on Amazon and figured I'd give it a try. So it's, I mean, I wouldn't say it's the most powerful thing, but like if you just are looking to kind of 
wash a floor. More I think power it, than a garden hose with the splitter. Yes, right. more than more than that. So we've got that hooked up on a splitter, and then the dog wash, and it's the hot water is so nice. I mean, I've even ran a hose from here through the house and filled up a kiddie pool for Brooklyn with nice warm water. Oh, did you? Yeah, because the water is too cold. Oh, so well, what a good dad. Yeah, I, well, you gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So. But yeah, I thought this area turned out great. And what we did, guys, we just took the outside siding. This is all that concrete James Hardy. Yep. We had a couple of other ideas, and it was just seemed flimsy, the fiberglass board. Yep. Stuff. So we just had Eugenio come in, yep. fill this all out. We've got a fiberglass shower pan. Is it the right height? I yeah, think we're about, height's, I height's perfect. Lucy stands this tall. I don't have to bend over. I can sit here and scrub her. It's, it's awesome. It's yeah. one of those same thing, just like the elevator, just like the AC unit. In fact, yeah. we tricked tricked out the garage just because that's yeah that's and kind the trash of, kind of my space and that was you oh, yeah. you, you you picked surprised that up you with that one yeah the trash it was, chute. It was I, a beef jerky dispenser yeah we used it for fulfilling jerky orders for but, for a while until we moved to that warehouse so. and then we got another super size heater so yep this thing should be cooking in the winter hopefully yeah you got the ac and the heat there yep. and here yep and then uh is this got that's the old fly trap. trap the flies right? are figuring it out but I suppose all you got to do is sit your trash can underneath and here just and you're good to go. And drop her down. We did yeah. your oversized garage doors. Yep. I mean, and this is a full size SUV in here, and it, it look at how much room. There, there. Yeah, you can fit three two F two fifties in here. Pretty good size. So I like the size of it. It turned out good. An original design. We had your steps on that side of the yep. house. Yep. And we changed it. We moved them clear over to this side, which I think makes a ton more it, sense. It, I like it. Yeah. It you're turned right out in good. And out of the house. Otherwise, you're walking around across cars. across the car. Yep. Yep. So that's part of it. Sometimes the plans are a plan. Doesn't mean they're perfect. We, yep. we keep working. And you had garages coming in from the front. Yeah. And we, we flipped, flipped them. them around yep. To the back. Back. Which I love that. I think that looks really good. And we do the really vertical <clears throat> garage lifts that yep. keeps the ceiling nice and clean. Those are the higher end, nicer, yeah. fairly quiet. I say they're really quiet. Yeah, I noticed that. So when these go up and down, you're upstairs, you don't interrupt the man cave. Plus this has all been insulated yep. really well. The right size. You can never get a big enough garage. No, no it can, this thing could be twice as big and I would be totally okay with it. But the good news is we have the shop so I can keep, again, kind of keep the house stuff here and all the YouTube shenanigans over there. It's and kind of nice to separate that sometimes. Brooklyn's toys. And yep. We can go back through the house. Yeah, we should probably, so before you get to the man cave, because that's yeah, we'll like the best save. part, we'll save that. So this is how you come into your home. That's yep. what started all this, is you come into a wonderful locker room. I mean, yeah, we haven't even began to do anything with this yet, but it's ready. Yeah. It's right. ready for it. And so, then you have a bench with your shoes underneath here. I'll say, yeah, we've got we've got shoes in here. All these have shoes. So Brooklyn's got her own. I've got some. Macy's got some. And then the hooks. Hanging up bags. I yep. always say people will put something on a hook before a hanger. But if yep. you have a hanger, you got a huge Yeah. Oh, I, I, I'll be honest. I forgot. That I haven't been in here yet, like, since we've moved in. Yeah, you haven't hung up anything in here yet. No. We, so, it's not wet. We don't need coats yet, I guess. I guess I got to break them out. I God. literally forgot this was here yeah. until you just said that. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't been in there one time. No, wait, no. Well, once it comes winter, we'll be loading yeah, it up. We'll Lucy, in. come here. And then also what some people make mistakes when they design their homes is you don't want to walk into a laundry room, but you want to have it close by and a bathroom. Yep. So we have a bathroom right off yeah, the door. Yeah, I say that. There's a, there's a bathroom right back here. Which show you. doubles as the guest bath from the entryway. Yep. They did these brick. Uh, pavered type floors. It's all tile. Yep. This comes right to the front door, but when so you come in, you get this big, nice area for. Yeah, this is this is huge. Yeah. This is awesome. I like really this area. Large. And then we put the stool behind another door. Yes. Because. So you got your own room. If somebody comes in this space and you interrupt somebody, they're at the sink. It's not a big deal. Yeah. Someone's on the bathroom. Yeah. Doing this. Yeah, yeah you don't want that. that. No, not, you can't. It's not have a, it. something you can't unsee. No, you don't. You definitely don't want that. So no, I like the design of. It makes it seem like everything kind of flows and you don't better having two a door bathrooms. here. You know, you save, save some, some money. money. Yeah, right, I'm all about that. So, and then, and then here's your favorite place, the laundry room. Yeah, oh, I'm in here daily, as you as you know. I'm well, always doing the I see you clothes and the dryer. stuff. Yeah, exactly. So. This is the oversized laundry room. This thing is huge. And they got windows. Yeah. I hear a big complaint with the gals and people that have them saying, I don't want to be in a closet. Gotcha. Doing my laundry. Yeah. I want to feel like I feel, can see outside. Yeah. It, it, feel outside is one thing. If you want to be outside, right here. You can be outside if you want to be outside. Right I mean, that's pretty. That's our screened in. Porch. That's pretty handy. So, oh, is, you want to see outside or be outside while doing laundry? You can. What I was thinking here, we could have done a full light door, but the downside is sometimes your laundry rooms aren't in order. Yeah. You know, so you got light coming in. But last la can see last thing you need is somebody seeing the the string of you know my yeah. underwear yeah. while we're out there eating or something. <laughs> that that okay. that'd just be a bad deal in general. Because you do your laundry so. in your underwear. Oh yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, we got the technical stuff yep. out of the way. The utilitarian. Now we're 
coming back through the kitchen. We can go to the back deck. So oh, yeah, let's walk over here. So you have two decks. You got the big monster one, and then you have this one off the kitchen that you're screened in. Yeah, port. so we, we actually had breakfast out here this morning. We eat dinner. We ate dinner last night here. We ate breakfast here this morning. So, so we vaulted the ceilings yep. and, and put the cedar on the ceilings, reset, got your speakers. Yep. These are the, the phantom screens that retract up and down. Yeah. So you can, <clears throat> if you want it down, if you don't want the bugs or the wind, but if you, if it's a nice day, you can lift them up. It's kind of nice to be able to choose. The views are spectacular. And oh yeah. One, the other day when I was up building the house that you could actually see Camel Ralph from the animals. He's, yeah, he's, yeah, you see him down there all the time running around. Your other house, you couldn't do any no, of that stuff. Cause no. they're way off the other end yeah. down, in, down in the ditch. It's nice to be able to keep an eye on them from up here. Yeah. We use this space all the time. And and then this people gave, a, awesome. gave you a bad time about selling me land in your backyard. My I house could, and stuff, you can't even I say, see. I say, I can't see your house. Is there's a, a there's, an enti there's an entire house over there. I cannot, you can't even see and any of it. And a greenhouse. And you can't see it. And then if you do end up doing anything on that side, you still can't way, see it. Way over there. So, so you know, it's a win-win. It's a win-win because he's my neighbor and I don't have to look at him. Yeah. So it's a, it's great. It's it's a win-win win all and I, overall. And he shares his toys. Which yeah, I do do that. Yeah. But your flooring you put down, Macy. Are you happy? You did the LVP. Hundred percent. Vinyl planks. Yeah. Oh yeah. It looks like wood, but yeah. it holds up way better versus with those. And we actually originally had a much darker flooring picked out, and like after a few months, I think I texted Lisa and I was like, I think we got to go back and reevaluate this because it was just going to be dust, you yeah. dog hair. If I come in here with dirty like shoes and walk, you can barely see it, which is nice because I do that all the time. Well, you're on the counter and that it does happen. That's another thing. I, I, I have seen homes where the floors are dark and even without a dog, the dust, I mean, they're it's constantly, constantly sweeping. Yeah. It, it's yeah. just... It's hard to relax, you yeah. know, because you get dirt and dust. <laughs> yeah. Here, right yeah. on the floor, you can't see it. Yeah. yeah. And that's what you want know, to enjoy your house. So yeah. breakfast here. And breakfast then here, and then this is where we spend the afternoons. Spend the afternoons hanging out over here, because it's always shaded. So the sun's the sun's almost gone over here already yeah, this in is the, the morning, morning, which is sun. nice, because so you get early. the morning sun, so it warms up. But we've got, this. Brooklyn loves it up here, because there's no... There's no steps. She can't it's fall safe. over. She can't, yeah, she can't do anything. So she can't escape. it's yeah. almost like you're outside but you're not. You're yeah, not. you guys get a little sneak peek of the pool. They haven't seen a whole lot of that, so, so it's coming along. That's a big pool. I say that's a big pool, but that's a huge hot tub. I didn't understand how big it was before, oh, just now. That is I mean, that's like a 20 person hot tub, I feel like. You could really, you could have a good party in there, and so. Then, and it's got the waterfall that's gonna It flow. spills over and it's got two fire bowls on the side. Oh, does it just really? Just flames and stuff, oh wow. yeah. And all that's like on some remote? Or how yeah, you... I'm guessing so. You just hit a button and. A button. So what are some other plans for out here in the back? Did so you... they're, we're gonna have a fire pit over on that side. Okay. So there'll be steps over there and then on that corner there's going to be a pergola Super it's like shade. the the thing and it's got the slats yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. like a solid roof but it oh. gives you some shade okay. so that'll be in the corner so you could sit there and like hang out by the tanning ledge or whatever and then we might call an audible remember we we're gonna have a hot tub under that deck yeah, I... which we still might because that hot tub does not work in the winter which is like the time you want to be in a hot tub but we're thinking about an outdoor kitchen below that deck now oh, but that'll okay. be like next year Okay. Would I get bored? I'm working with a new company that has awesome cabinets for outdoors. Oh, really? It's always been a struggle trying to get cabinetry that yeah. works outdoors. I mean, yeah. it's a special material. So I'll, I'll check into that for okay. you before you pull. Maybe the maybe next summer yeah. if we want to if we want to come up with a nice nice little project, we could do that. Because you you have everything is so well done. Last thing you want to do is all of a sudden you're wheeling your grill out. Yeah, no, we don't want that. You might you yeah. want it to be part of the outdoor living space. Yeah. But the views are spectacular. Yeah. One, they're always wondering where should Flair put a zip line? Are you have you are we still? I'm, I'm thinking from about where that that porta potty is down to the lake is kind of what I want to I want to go over the lake. You see the I mean that pond is huge yeah it turned out pretty big size i didn't think we we're going to be able to, to see it but yeah that is all water down there. yeah it's massive i think the zip line would be great i think it'd be good jump right in the, right into the pond just go fast enough i don't know do you have brakes on those so you can slow it down or you just got to hit the pond you just got to you just got to go you just got to go you just got to go for it yeah <laughs> i hope your swimsuit doesn't go all the way up yes. into where it can't all the hard to reach spots you don't want that no hey, yeah good. but yeah awesome. this i love the deck i mean the cedar we still have a tv that we're going to hang up here um, which will be nice, and then the, yep, uh, the fireplace so you can see through it. That's your master bedroom. Also. Yeah. So you can come out and enjoy this deck from yeah at any at any time. It yeah. is nice. And then you want you want to see my little. This is what I came up with one night. A solution for two things. One, washing the deck because there's always dust on it. That's just right. how it is with all the dirt. Yes. And then two for Brooklyn because this is like her little water thing. Okay. So I ran a hose down, and then they make these little decorative. So this is. A hose, but we don't have a hose bib up here, but. Yeah. And I'll explain why there's not a hose bib. Because you do not have 
uh, I need a wall. So if I had a wall sitting right here and went in and then this went around, I can put a hose bib. There's not one wall that's eight yeah. to 10 inches deep. So that's all bedroom. If I put one in, you'd have to have a cabinet inside there. Cause yeah. I always like to put them on here, but there was no place. Yeah. So that's that a great solution. <laughs> For I don't know, maybe eighty bucks on Amazon, huh. and they make they make them look like potting plants. You can put plants on them and there, stuff. Yeah. If anyone's looking for a, a cheap way to get water somewhere, so I have to admit, you're very resourceful. The stuff you come up with for the kids, you know, you yeah. got she wants she wants a water table up here <laughs> yeah. on the upper deck, which by the way is nice because it doesn't rain down because of the ladder system. Yeah, it's another which thing, right? we love. So that. when you have the pool going and splashing, <clears throat> anybody downstairs is not getting wet because yep. it goes in here and down the bladder system out yep. the drain. So. We, we're up here all the time. This is one of our favorite places to hang out. So. Before the hose, I was carrying out bowls. Uh, bowls. Yeah, yeah, so I, I went, after I saw that, I figured it out. Yeah, and that was killing me because I was trying somewhere to put a hose bib because I know once you get moved in, these are things that people don't think about. Yeah, I, I didn't think about that at all. Until yeah. you get moved in, you go, that ding dong builder, why didn't he ask us for a hose bib? There is no place to put one yeah. in here without it uh, freezing. Yeah, Can't, so, especially uh, with the winters we have. Oh, all right, well, we'll we can go, go back around. Do, do you, you want to go back around or you want to shoot through uh, here? Well, we could take a shortcut and come yeah, right through take, the- uh, Take a shortcut. This is how the flares live. I want to see this here. So this is the master. I love the wall color. This was- w uh, Went a little darker. Yeah, Try elephant ear, I remember Yes, that. it was written right there I on the wall that the we wall. blew out. Remember and they that? still painted it the wrong color. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, they did, but it's all good. It, come, yeah. it came back, it looks good, so but we like a, it though. It's a good size room. I mean, what makes, I mean, these beds are huge when you start going up. Yeah. But I remember when we started the beginning designing, Macy wanted this little seating area yeah. over here because the ceiling uh, is tops a little short yeah. to allow this light fixture to come down. I, I like sitting here. We'll sit here and look outside and hang out here. Yeah. It's kind of nice to be able to have something. We got a TV, a great view of the pond. Yeah, you can almost take these chairs and flip them around. Yeah, that's what we do, we sit there and look out there, but it's nice to just have a spot to kind of sit down and hang out. We've also told the people, we got all, all the ceilings are so tall, but we did eight foot tall doors yep. throughout the entire house. Yep, makes everything feel much bigger. Makes it much bigger. And yep. so this is a zone, you have your own thermostat for your master bedroom, so you can keep this as cold or warm as you want. Yep. And then around the corner. We've got his and hers closets. Macy's got a closet in there. That is She's nice. got all of her clothes hung Very up. Very organized, and, Macy. Looks yeah, I say, good. mine's not going to be nearly oh, that no, organized, no. You're still not even unpacked. It no, like. I, I still got saran wrap over my dresser. Okay, but. so tell me about this electric toilet. So when you, if work? you walk in, it greets you. And it just went up when you Yeah, I didn't touch anything. Door. Yeah. And it already knows, does pre, it know pre, what you're going to be doing? Pre sprays and gets you going, yeah. It's ready to rock. Does it read your mind or does it... And then oh. there's, a, there's a remote here. You can make it do all sorts of things. You can spray. You can dry, you can adjust the spray, you can have it pulse, you can have it do a bunch of stuff, and you can have like player one and player two. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That, I, I, mean, I built a lot of houses. I have to say this at first. Is that, I, I've, at least I don't regret that. Yeah. It's a good, it's a good one. But you have to have electrical outlets. We you, put you them do. on all your toilets. Yeah, that's a good call. Just in case you change rooms at some point. Yeah, you never know. Yeah, I so we, we love that, yeah. Do you even have a, yeah, got a toilet paper roll just, just in, in case. case. But you don't need toilet paper. Okay. It's not it's not required, okay? Uh, well, there's plenty in the porta potty. Yeah. When, when is there? So then here's this my closet. Here. Except I'm not I'm still not even unpacked. Oh, I see your I've just got all sorts of Yeah, I see your camouflage t-shirts. I got a couple couple t-shirts in couple there. A couple camouflage uh, sweatshirts. That's about it though. Once camouflage goes out of style, you're done. Yeah, I'm out, I, yeah, I'm out of business. <laughs> he got yeah. to, he's got to start shopping again. So, so which sink is yours? This one's mine. Down here? Yep. All right. Yep, so this is my sink, her sink, heated floors, if you can oh, feel I it. Oh, I can feel the floors nice That's, and warm. And, and even, in, even in the summer, it's nice. You wouldn't think nice. that you would like that in it's, the summer. It's nice, even in the summer. Especially getting out of the shower, then your feet aren't cold, yeah, it feels which nice. is nice. And then and our infamous tub. There, here that, it is, yeah. the 700 pounder. It's, I've, I'm in it actually more than you would think. You it's pretty, actually oh yeah, it's, 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 it's good for a soak every once in a while. It's yeah. nice and comfortable. It's really nice. So you've got a lot of room in here, and, and what was kind of fun, Lisa and Macy came up with yeah. this. I think Macy did. Yeah, the lights are the little light they're pretty cool. detail on the ceiling, and yeah. this massive walk around shower. Yeah, this thing, it just it just keeps on going. It seems like it never stops. Does, does the tile floor, the stones, they say it's kind of like a little foot massage. Yeah, it, I don't mind it at all. I think it Look turned out pretty thing. good. It is huge. Yeah, it's you got big. the ceiling spray, yeah. the wall spray, and the then hand spray. The Mr. Microphone spray. That's right. That's all right. It's like a car wash effect yeah. when you turn everything on at once. You don't have to move, you just stand there. You stand still and, and it just get it gets every crevice, believe Jeez. it or not. Yeah, you get it here and the toilet. If you ain't clean, there's something. That's what I'm saying. All about all about the cleanliness out here, okay? <laughs> that's all that's all we're worried about. 
I so, haven't, uh, that yeah. is nice. That people, some people say, ah, don't put the door on there, leave it open. It makes a huge difference because we didn't have the door for the first week or two and it was fine. But when you put that door on there, it'll keep that heat in there so much better to where you can sit there and dry off and you're not shivering. It's the door helps a lot. Not only I'm just a keep fan. the water, it's just really for warmth. Yeah, yeah. the war it made a huge difference on keeping it warm in there. I would suggest that too. It looks cool without them, but it's yeah, you know, freeze their it's too cold. Them. Definitely too cold. So So we got everything when we got the kids. Let's see Brooklyn's room. You wanna see Brooklyn's room? Okay. She has pink cabinets and a window that we didn't know. So that was a that was yeah, a fun I, one to discover. That was a nice yeah. surprise. How yeah. how embarrassing is a home builder? <laughs> She's real close to you yeah, guys. Right through here. So this is Brooklyn's room. This is where wow, we, we this added this nice. wallpaper last weekend. Macy's okay. mom came and helped us out. No, you guys did it yourself, the mm -hmm. wallpaper? A little DIY action. Not wow. me, I, I didn't do anything. Did but. you hang some of the wallpaper, Macy? Yeah, it wasn't very fun. <laughs> it's it's a little it, difficult, but. It's peel and stick though. So we didn't have to do like the water. Yeah, but you gotta match up everything. Yeah, yeah on the seams, yeah. That. I thought that turned out pretty good. Added By the a little way, customization. Your mom helped you in this? Yeah, she's like the wallpaper. Yeah. So that's expert. how this all came about. I built your mom and dad's house yeah. two doors down yeah. um, about 10 years ago or so. Yeah, yeah. it's like 2015. I was going into my senior year of high yeah. school. And I remember we had, I didn't had not met you, but they go, oh. our daughter Macy, we got to have this room here. <laughs> the youngest kid gets all yeah, the Yeah, shocker. Stuff. Oh, I'm not yeah. surprised. Yeah. Even at 17. Yeah. yeah. And Chandeliers and, yeah. and oh yeah, I and remember. And then there's a new pickup in the driveway. I go, who's that? They go, oh, that's Macy's boyfriend. Just oh, like, geez. I'm like, what? is he doing? He's only 16. <laughs> That's the YouTube started. That, oh, that's yeah. how it started, yeah. Oh my God, I should have paid more attention back then. <laughs> I could have had Brad the Builder a long time there ago. There you go. And you have a great mother-in-law. I do, yes, I do, yeah. Father. She's got a Totally She's got the best view the best in the view house. Of the pond, right? Yeah, the best view of the pond yeah. for sure. It's through here, which is yeah. really nice. So is Chad? Uh, most of his equipment it's off to the side. It's, is he about done? Or what he's else? getting pretty close. I think we should be done with the pond probably within a week, okay. and then we'll be starting to fill it if it hold, if it holds water. Okay. Fingers crossed. I, I want to help. No guarantees you. there. Okay. But I want to help you. Uh, you mentioned something about a uh, a little boathouse. Yeah for a marina, whatever. Yep. I've got some, if you'll let me, I wanna do some yeah, let's do it. builder stuff on that and get the Beefcake Boys involved. Yes, I'm down. Okay, Yeah. I got some great ideas. Okay. Maybe you guys can give us some ideas too. Yeah. I, I think it should look old. I agree, I agree. So I'm gonna clear my warehouse out. Okay, all right. Guys, these are pink. These are the pink cabinets, right inf in infamous here. pink cabinets. And we would have a mirror if I would have found the window earlier. Yeah. So every one little delay, but now because they it, didn't know there was a window, we don't have drapes. <laughs> Say, I got Amazon cardboard up there for the lighting for when she goes to bed. To bed yeah. So we'll, we'll, we, we're waiting on the curtains. They're I, on should, I should probably buy you curtains because uh, we <laughs> hid your window for the longest till after you almost you were moved in. Yeah. And they're hanging the mirror and they drill the hole and they saw daylight. So that's what started all this. That's it. She got a walk-in closet and then this is yep. a shared bath. Yep. Jack and Jill. So. Really nice colors, the, the tile, and we did uh, I mean, these, we did kind of the oversized tub. Yeah. And then another a bathroom. Right another here, another bathroom which here. Which turns yeah. into a playground. Yeah, this is the Brooklyn's playroom. For this extra, because you have two guest bedrooms downstairs. Yes. This house has five. Yeah, five beds, five not beds. including the man cave. Okay. So it could be up to six. Six bedrooms. Yeah. But when you have little kids, they have so much stuff that yep. it's either in the living room where you're living yep. or you make a room for them. Exactly. That's why we right. did this. That way the toys can stay in yeah. here. She can make as big of a message as she wants. Yeah. And the main house stays looking good. You like good, your room? So. Is this your, oh, there's your chair. Brooklyn, yeah. Don't, right there. Yeah, you can't steal. It's got her name on it. Nice. We love this room. We're in here all the time. And it's nice. But having windows too, because you don't feel like you're like down in a, if you know, if you're in the lower level, which is a lot of playrooms are, I feel like you just feel like you're up in. Yeah, even if there's you know. a walkout, it just yeah. doesn't feel so open. It's yeah. Good. Thank you. Wow. This little cowboy. I got a little cowboy. There it is. Thank you. I'll re-gift it. <laughs> yeah, I can hang out in here. You guys yeah. take on with the tour. I'm going to hang out. Okay, all place. right. Finish up. I'm going to oh, play with this they, Mr. They, chicken. There you go. You're having troubles with your chickens. Yeah, I you? know. They keep getting where the raccoons are getting to Darn, them. I thought you got all the raccoons. I know. They The suckers keep reproducing. I don't know. So let's go. So now we're entering back out into the, the main living area. Yeah, that's pretty and, much uh, most of the first level. We pretty much saw everything. But what's nice, it's a big house, but you can, a lot of times people build big homes, but they only live in one certain part. Yeah. You really are able to live in the whole main floor. And yeah. And downstairs is a whole nother yep. living space. Yeah. So we can head downstairs. Okay. Show you guys some We supersized the staircase. It's extra wide. And these are some of the little touches that we did by putting this on the wall to break up these big walls. 
And that's just basically at the baseboard we put yeah. on the wall. Yeah. You probably didn't even know we did nope, that. Nope, I didn't know it. I didn't notice until it was all painted up. So this is the lower level. We have yet to do yeah. anything down here, but that's- That is a big couch. It, it's a large couch, yeah. I think I saw over here with these screens, there's still a few things that we have to address. These can go on there, but it's, I don't think it's necessary yeah. to call those guys. But anyway, I'll leave it here for now and we'll move it. But again, you have the same fireplace. Upstairs is down. It's yep. see-through. So when see -through. you're out the pool, you got TVs. And here's again, it's that same deflector. Yeah, you wouldn't even you know. you really don't see because it blends right in. So yeah, so, massive <laughs> massive couch. Like, so we're not down here. you've even sat all, on this couch. No, have I haven't, no. We haven't, we haven't spent a ton of time down here. But we figured once the kids get older and start bringing their friends out, you just shoo yeah. them downstairs. That's what they'll be. What, they can go hang out down you're here. You're at a stage where... When they get a little older and they're friends, they want a place to go. So yep. be up. We even put outlets in the floor yep. right here. So once this couch gets moved ahead, you can plug it in, so in case you want a lamp or something behind it. Yeah. You don't want cords running to the wall. Because yep. the rooms are so big, you don't put furniture against, against the, wall. the walls. Yeah, got it. That makes sense. Um, yep. Let's see. Let's, we'll save Which that. Which way do you want to go? You want to save that? Last. Okay. We'll go through oh. here. There's a bookcase. That's kind of odd. That's it with one book. Oh, well, oh, well. That's such an odd design. Why would you build an entire bookcase for one book? I, so we're coming to the part no of the idea. house that there's another bedroom exercise. Yeah, there's the, there's the I said you can Let's check out check quick. out the gym. So we had this stuff at the old house, so we set it in here. I mean, you guys use it every once in a while, but yeah. not not enough clearly. Well, what's so. nice about this room? You've got these views looking out the pool, the, so you don't feel like you're down in a dungeon. No, yeah, you're it is nice. To work out, you got room for a TV on the wall. And then I say same same thing as upstairs. The the Jack and Jill goes through. So you got your own sink and world's largest mirror. And all these sinks, are, I mean, everything we've it's done huge. is oversized. Yeah, so it's huge. Most sinks in some of these bathrooms are like 30 inches. This is like a six foot long sink. Big walk-in closet. Yep. And then we've got you, the shower. Yeah. So here's a shower I did a couple, little video on. The, so your shower is four foot wide. Yep. But I framed the wall, brought it back. Yep. So that when you're in the shower, you now have, instead of a four foot shower, it's five foot and you get a seat. Yeah, that's nice. It's I just, like that. It's an inexpensive way to make your shower bigger. Yeah. Uh, I like that. It looks like no one's even used that. Have not turned the water on there yet? No, I have not. This, this swings around into the you exact identical bathroom. Yep, same thing. And, and then, then a guest suite we just here. we just got the guest suite set up. Haven't obviously had any guests in it yet, but it's it's getting there. But these are huge bedrooms. Yeah. Another thing people do in bedrooms is uh, since the TVs back in the day were about two and a half, three foot wide, yeah. you needed from the headboard to the TV wall, like 14, 15 feet. Okay, I got so it. So a, a bed's about seven to eight. Yep. So then you need a three foot walkway. So eight and then nine, 10, 11, maybe 12. That's okay. what a bedroom could be. You okay. probably have 13 or 14. So since the TV's real thin, you can now make your bedrooms a little narrower. Gotcha. And, and take the extra space to make it wider if you want to. Yeah, nice. But uh, yeah, I was bringing that up. But so again, windows looking out the pond. Yep. Huge walk-in closet. Yep. And we kept the same. Theme. Same baseboards, oversized baseboards. Yep. Same. All right. So then through here, this is the movie theater room. Ooh, look at this. Look at that. Oh, look who's on. That's, wow. Oh, look at that. That's is a, that always streaming? It, 24 hours a day. Flare. Gotta get the views up somehow. You know, <laughs> just gotta. Right. Just gotta keep it going. So yeah, movie theater room turned out really good. So this room, it's a good size, and we have the indirect light tray. You did the projector earlier. I think we had a screen on. Yeah. And you said, ah, not we big need enough. a bigger. We need a bigger screen. I agree. Yeah. That fits. The, the it looks room. really good. Wonderful. How how big is that screen? I don't remember. I think it's. I want to say like 160, 150 maybe. I could be wrong. Yeah, because we had it's, like a 10 footer in here. Yeah. I think 12. it was 10. Yeah. 10, and it looked like it was a little tiny screen yeah. TV. So the up the upgrade's nice. Oh yeah, I'll, I'll kick. So, we got some other lights i'll kick some lights on so you can see there, there you go, go. Yeah. there you go now you can see right. so we've got a couch here which we actually i mean the movie theater seats are great but when you're just like watching tv we like sitting on the couch which is kind of nice so it's just and it's, a, it's a big i've never seen a couch like this yeah everybody just kind of lays out i think they call them like cloud couches what they call them so it's right? like you're sitting on a cloud can you so stay, i saw it on can tiktok you stay with that? if i was in there i'd be sleeping in 15 minutes. i'd fall asleep a lot right yep. here yep and then we've got the bar with the refrigerator that's got all the all the drinks, and then we've got all, all this the snacks. Yeah, I got some. Wow, it's like going to the movies. You, you don't have to. Go. You don't. No, no one goes to movie theaters anymore. So oh, you, yeah, we got the popcorn. You got popcorn. Look, we've got fre freshly popped popcorn in there. You said you had a popcorn. I didn't believe you. They had this thing. So how about? It's an <laughs> it's an actual popcorn machine. Whoop! What's Lucy? Lucy, dog. The dog's broken. <laughs> Lucy, go lay down. <laughs> Lucy. She's crazy. He is crazy. Hi, buddy. So. Uh, so yeah. 
So you get the popcorn going. You got your microwave. Yep, microwave. And um, yeah. the sunken living room area. Yep. And then you got all the all the theater seats that recline out with the lights front and center. Dude, so these turn out pretty good. Let me climb in, even though you got them extended. Let me take a look here. How's that feel? Ooh, man, these are nice. You got cup holders. You can just these just vibrate. And all they that don't. Stuff. They don't massage. I wish they There's did. A lot of buttons. But here it's got push. it's got like lumbar support. You can choose oh, like if you want your head reclined or not. You know, yeah. being right here, I don't feel like I'm too close. No, you're really, you're, you know, you're really in it, you know. And your face is really big. It's just screen. right there. It's right there for <laughs> it's you. It's right there. So we actually use this, a lot of, like, I've always heard people, they build them and they say, oh, we don't really ever use it. We're in here almost every night. Why would I watch TV on a normal TV when you have a, yeah, yeah, a that's theater? What I was wondering you know, too. I feel like it makes but, the most so sense. So you guys do. You come down, and hang out. Lucy looks like yeah. she, she's got her Lucy, spot. Lucy knows where to hang out. Yeah, yeah. I would really. Like, I think it turned out good. Some of, you said you've so you got a subwoofer that's what's behind there. Yep. You've got uh, all the speakers. Uh, I yep. Forget, it's a seven point one or two. I forget that that thing. It's okay. Five. You've got multiple speakers. bunch of speakers. One, yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's what it is. So, yeah. Um, there's a lot. So do you get that real movie theater effect? Oh yeah. Turning on. Yeah. Like Surround theater? sound, popcorn. I mean, like I said, there's no reason to go to the movie theater when you have something like this. And when you just, you just, when you watch it, you just kind of turn off. Yeah. Oop. We usually watch it, Oop. turn that Oop. one off. That one off. And then we usually watch it like this. So you just let You've the got indirect light that light and then the stairs, the so you don't, you don't fall. That's, yeah. And then you're good to go. We haven't seen the Four Seasons room, gun safe, sports court, and the man cave. That That is correct. There's oh, still yeah. a lot to go. That's like two, three more houses. Yeah, I know. All right, well, let's, let's get moving. <laughs> we can go to the other, okay. the other wing, I guess you could call it. So here's the big custom glass sliding door we did. And the idea behind this, since this is your Four Seasons room, yep. you know, like right now in the, in the summer or whatever, winter, you want to leave it open to enjoy it all. Yeah. You get, well, when your pool's done, it's going to be 90 and 100 degrees out. Yeah. You close this and open up all these doors with your own heating and cooling system, yep. you can come and go and all that hot air does not go through your whole Got house. it, yeah. No, that's gonna be, that'll be super nice for everybody to come and go. And it'll feel like this is just an extension of the backyard. You come into the bar and get a drink and some food, some snacks. I mean, there's an ice machine. Oh yeah, you there's all ice. sorts. There's all sorts of good stuff. Yeah, yeah, you got your dishwasher, so you have to take yeah. all your glassware from down here stays here. Pretty yep. Cool. And then you got the ice, ice maker. Ice maker, cubed ice. Oh, you it's, got like it's like crushed ice. Yeah, Can it's all it's like Sonic. You ever been to Sonic? They have the little oh. the cubed ice. Did you order stuff. it that way? Oh yeah, it's the best kind of ice. The only kind of ice. Really? I yeah. thought there'd be little squares or something. That's no. nice. Yeah, the cubed ice is my favorite. So. And then uh, big beautiful back wall. You got yep. your TV. Here. TV for sports games. If we're throwing a pool party during a Husker game or something. And again, this LVP flooring. I think yep. it's the same that's upstairs. Same. Right? Yep, it's the same as upstairs. Yep. And here's what I think is great on the design is that you have this kind of a pool mudroom. Yeah. Right? So come, oop, try to let Lucy. Yeah, she can go out. That's can okay. She go out? So this goes right outside. So this will go right outside underneath the deck to the pool. So when your people are coming in, going to the bathroom. Yeah. And they want shade, they can hang up their towels. They got a bench. I don't know, beach shoes. Yeah. Sandals. Yeah. And then a, another half bath yeah. right here. And then the herringbone this brick. This good. The brick pattern. Yeah. It's turned out good. You did a great job on the selection. Oh, I after. picked out everything. Oh yeah, hundred percent. It's all just all me. Well, you tried to, and they got X Yeah, yeah, yeah Macy. I, I, Macy I, took over. Yeah, yeah. So we finally got the front panels on the bar down here. We had a couple ideas going reclaim wood. I think that's a nice look because there there was a suggestion with the fireplace mantle being rustic, but man, you see this looks good right here. And then they have a full refrigerator with a freezer. So if you're cooking out, you've got your hamburgers, hot dogs, ice cream. I like this. Tell me about this, Andrew. This thing? Yeah. This is, it's just a, it's like a refrigerator. Oh, it is working. It it's just a cooler, like a refrigerator basically, but it's on wheels and it's got a little bottle opener. So we figured like pool parties and stuff, you go put this next to the pool. So you don't even have to walk in here if you don't want for a cold beverage. Oh, before we pour the deck then out there, let's make sure we get some underground power out. Oh some yeah, outlets. that'd be smart. Okay. Yeah, I like that. So we'll talk about that. Okay. And also, as you know, when they do the pool, there's all these grounding rods that has to take place. Yep, got which, it. Um, the electrician will know, but let's keep that in mind. I'll yeah. the hot tub so you can move this around and plug stuff That'd be in. cool. Okay. Yeah, He's, you don't have to get out of the pool to get a drink. I, I feel like, like that. Would be, that it's would be on good. wheels. Perfect. You, you show them this yet? Oh yeah, your big nano wall. So I've been, I've been scared to use it. No, yeah, don't be scared. It's ready to go. Does it push? Or was out? it was it locked? Was it unlocked already? No, lift up. Oh, oh it pushes out. We got, oh, we got a hose on the way. Oh, I see. Actually, it all, it all comes this towards you. There we go. And then that opens up. Push it again. So soon that dirt will be 
pool decking. So that is going to be cool to be able to just walk to the yeah, pool from here. And then here. I flip these doors around so this one opens up and then that one opens up because they were going the wrong way. So now you have all this open air yeah. coming into this. This is going to be sweet. Shaded. It yeah. should be not a four season. It should really, I always like to call it more like a beach club. Yeah. Yeah. I really like this. Was, although it was a little pricey, a little pricey it turned out pretty cool. Or I could have put a glass garage door in and that'd be cool, but this is cooler. Gotcha. No, this turned out good. I like and it. And I don't know if the people can see too, but this will be underneath your main deck. Yep. You can just, we won't go out because it's so dirty and the pool guys are showing up. But now you got your outdoor fireplace. Yep. Yeah, it looks fine. I, it looks I, fine I Yeah, I, I like it. Yeah, we're so, thinking some outdoor dining out there would be, would be nice so you can sit in the shade next to the pool, yeah, eat a meal, which should be kind of nice. This I love this room. This room turned out pretty good. Are you selling pool passes? Can I yeah, ne next there? summer. Next summer? I, well, yeah, I think probably next summer at this rate. Like I'll even but. hose off the patio. Well, yeah. Do whatever it takes to be. I won't put lotion on for hard to reach spots. <laughs> no? Okay. Yeah. Then uh, we're going to save. We can save that after. for the last, yeah. So this was a part we even added. I mean, this was always here, but it was all storage. And so we decided to, oh, look at this. You didn't know this, Andrew? Oh, turn around. It's like magic. No, it won't fall. Really? That is pretty it? crazy. Yeah, I didn't know you crazy? could stand it up straight. Yeah, so you don't have to lean it. No, I have to lean it. Really? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so now we got a little mini game room back yeah, here. I, I had no place to put this from the last house, but I figured this would be good. And then eventually, maybe like a dartboard could go here. Yeah, you got plenty So of people could basically kind of just come back in here and be loud and shut the door so they don't disturb everybody else. Because like this kiddos. door, which is shown, we just made a circle. This goes right back into the Yeah, it goes right into the, the bar. Beach club. Yep. So this door can be left open, come and go. Come and go, and yep. Games, but then it goes yep. into something yeah. really yeah. cool. Yeah, to, to the sports court, under the garage. That is something we added to the design, right? To yep. that. So it's starting to become. It's, it's, it, it, we haven't done much to it, but it's here at least. This. Here's some uh, sound boards that you're going to be trying out, isn't it? We got to hang up a lot of those, of those to get that, that echo wall. you guys hear out of here. Also, on the ceiling, on the walls, but we'll... Also works great when kids run into it. They got yeah, yeah, that, yeah, exactly. But this echo, it will go away when you put up like a rubber mat down. Yeah. And some of that on the wall. You are in a concrete bunker. Yeah, like any, any tornadoes garage. come, yeah, this is where you'll find me. I think those walls are 12 or 14 inch thick of concrete. Oh yeah, it's yeah, impressive. this turned out really good. So we're excited, this is, I'm saving this for a winter. Okay. A winter project. Because when it's cold outside, then I can come and, and get down. have something to do in January, February when Does you can't do Brooklyn a lot outside. Does even know that she has this? I She's been in here a couple times. She okay. like she comes in here and yells. She enjoys oh. she enjoys hearing her her voice. But we're gonna hopefully over the winter remodel this thing and get it all get it more into a sports court. I guess I'm excited. It'll be a really fun project, and I think it's gonna be one of those that, things that evolves. You know, as the kids get older, you might go from. You know, little play sets to basketball courts to stuff like that. Yeah, so it will change. Because one time we talked about like a little mini city. Yep. You know, for just out of cardboard and travel yep. around. I say once the kids are out of here, then it'll be bow range, maybe a bowling alley. Yeah, you got I a mean, ping pong table. I yep. Mean, you can put a hoop. You could have multiple events going. Yeah. Exactly. We should have like a like a little obstacle course contest. A little Olympic games. Yeah, Olympic games. Ping Olympic pong, games under the garage. Free throws. Yeah, bowling. we could. Yeah. I'll have to come up with that. Did I leave that light on? No, you're good. Oh, that, it it turns, turns off. Turns yeah. On yep. And then your furnace room, he's got all geothermal, high yep. energy efficiency throughout the whole house. So now the thing that we uh, also added that you had to have the book, right? The, the one book. The one book. I need to buy more books. But as of right now, just one book and un, uh, not suspicious bookcase that opens into what I think is one of the coolest gun rooms. Wow, okay, come on in. There we go. This has got to be the coolest. This is the coolest room in the house by far. I mean, come on now. Man. This is tough to beat. Holy cow. And I saw you guys set all this stuff up. Yeah. Right? Uh, you know, the big discussion was we had a water issue in yep. here. Yep. Thank God we haven't had any water, so no, we're good. We're good. We well, haven't had it. any rain. That's also <laughs> true. Yeah, we, we haven't I had think, any rain. I know we got it fixed. Yeah. I'm yeah. Positive. You've got still got room to go. I mean, you've, oh, that is a huge collection of yeah. guns. I didn't know I had this many until this we set them all out like come this. Come out of your backyard? That was at the backyard of the old house. That was the first cow I trapped with a foothold. These, what's the story behind this little The guy? badger, that was at one of the, the farms, the old farms, we just trapped him, trying to catch, trying to catch him. And then these, these, so these guys came from Africa. This is a warthog and a wildebeest. And you shot all these? Mm -hmm. 
looks like. And it means something again. If you hunt that, or it's going to hunt you. Exactly. Yep. Then, got a couple of deer and. Where's the freak? He's up in the man cave. Oh, he's yes. got to be the star of the show oh, for the catching cooks. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So we've got him. We got him hanging up up there. So but. we brought. This was a room that was full. Of, where it's going to be full of dirt. And yeah. We said, God, let's fill this thing up. Take the dirt out. Yep. And make a gun safe. Out yeah. Of it. Which I didn't know it was possible, but it turned out really good. I really and do. And that's like why it. we have little water issues. We've got it all fixed, but. This was not even on the blueprint. No, right? yeah, no. And so that's why some people go, well, that bookcase, I would have done it different. This was something that we added. Yeah, we had, to, we had to do with what we could. Yeah. yeah, we didn't have a whole lot of flexibility yeah. out of it. I still think it turned out great. Okay, we got 11 foot ceilings. You got the steps up. You can even, there's so much more that you can continue yeah. to grow into. Tell that to Macy, I need more guns. Oh, see, yeah. oh she picked her head up. Like, yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> there's still room to grow. Still is room. This yeah. is kind of a hangout, then what do you, is this here? This for, is where we do all the accessories. So you can, like, a, you put your guns in a vise. So you can change stuff, mount scopes, put on lasers, red dots, so cleaning stuff. And everything is right in here. We also have yep. it so that there's a dehumidifier. Yep. And that's what these vents are on yep. the wall. One viewer said someone can crawl through there. The hole's that big around. Yeah, if you so can get through there, you can have it, I you guess. Can have it, yeah. yeah, good luck. So this will hunt some heat and cool and dehumidify. That's always a big concern yeah. with a concrete room. Yeah, especially with a bunch sweating. of guns. Right. You don't. No humid, you don't want any moisture no in here. Moisture. So, so far, nothing's even shown a speck of rust, which is good. Everything looks good. This is cool. What do you, I mean? Yeah, this turned out great. Who has one of these? Not not many people. Yeah. Not many people. You deserve this. This is do I? right I, up your alley. I appreciate that. Yeah. The vault door, where'd that thing come from? This, this demo ranch, he just has these suckers laying around, I guess. He's like, hey, you want one of these? I've got a bunch of laying around. So I went down, we shot it with a 50 cal, and then he gave me this one instead, instead of the shot. He had one. one you can shoot at. Yes, to test, can... test the durability, it passed my durability test, so then he gave so me one. Most guys leave you with a t-shirt and a koozie. Yeah. You got a yeah. vault door. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, what a good, what a good I, guy. I, I need to go down and see. I know, him. I know. You never know what you're gonna come back with. I can help with. him design stuff on That's this exactly, house. exactly. So we got you what you didn't know you wanted, but yep. a hidden bookcase with one book. So far, closes. one book. One book. We're getting no, there. There'll be more. We're going to be adding some books. If you want to so. buy him something for Christmas, gotta get him a book. Give me. A, someone send me a book so it doesn't look so suspicious. Lots of pictures. Yeah, we need lots of books. No, no, so. because who wants to read? Yeah, I know. All right, well, so we got we, one last thing. Oh, yeah, we got to go to the favorite part. So we're going to move our way upstairs to the man, man cave. cave. Right. All right, boys, the Ooh. man cave. Here what do you, it is. What do you think? You asked, you asked about him. Oh, there's the freak. Here he is, the okay. freak. And this here, is this what... Oh, he's big, and that's just uh, yeah. What the heck is it's that? Called, it's called drop tie. They're they're not all that common. Oh. So when you get them, they're they're pretty special. So you put them on the wall, and you give them a name. Yep. What, that, that, did it come that's, with the No, tag? that's a tag. That's my tag to say like it's mine basically. Oh, I see. Yep. So. So this was going to be a storage room. Yep. Then it was going to be the dog condominium. Yep. And then we turn it into the man cave, which then turned into a whole full kitchen for yeah. catch, cook, and clean. Did I say that catch, right? Catch, clean, cook. Catch, clean, It doesn't cook. matter, technically. D-Y-I-D-I-I-D. -I -I it, 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 listen, it's, it, you, guys, you get what he's saying. It's all words. Yeah, yeah, so kitchen, full kitchen. We use this place all the time. This is great. Here. Yeah, there it is oh, right there. That. So we stand here. We'll chef it up, cook. You got oven down. You do have a I didn't figure out how that works oh, yet. It just starts. Just hit the on button. Yeah, so we've got tons of cabinets. It's still kind of a mess, like everything else. But then we've got sink, another microwave, another dishwasher, another dishwasher. Yeah. How many of these microwaves do we have in here? I think there's five. There's quite a few. Yeah. One, two. Yeah, five, four or five. Four, four or five. Microwaves. Yeah. Okay. I guess if you buy three, you get two. Is that? Is that did so I get that deal? I might. I thought I missed that. Full so, refrigerator, so stocked with is it condiments of, mostly. Where's the beef jerky? There's, oh, the jerky. That's, a, that's at the warehouse. Oh, yeah, we got evicted, remember? Out. Yeah. So this, we got a window there, but you closed that for we, 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 we Yeah, we blacked it out because otherwise for filming, you can't quite see. It's tough to see sometimes when you're filming. Yeah. But, but you did this. We did a video on this supersized countertop. Yep. This big, massive edge. Yep. I mean, everything is oversized and very masculine. Yeah, this room. that's right. The but man cave. We had a chance. Yeah, to that's what I'm kept, saying. May see in the design. Yeah, itself. stay out of this. There's your trash. Chute, yeah, the trash. Yeah, the trash chute that goes down into the garage right over here. So that was the functioning beef jerky. This is what we used for the beef jerky chute. So you throw your chute yep, down, throw short it down the chute, or the jerky. Yeah, short lived, right? But anyway, we have a warehouse now, so you can't complain, All I guess. Right. So and then we haven't done a whole lot in this space. We, we put a couch up here. 
and then it didn't really fit. And then we needed room for beef jerky. So we took the couch out and sold the couch and I need a new couch. Well, one couch wouldn't fit up the steps because of all the turns. Yeah. But you did get one up here? No, I didn't get the, the one that's down in the, the theater room. We thought about bringing here and getting something bigger down there. Oh, okay. We're still playing with it. You need like apartment size furniture. Yeah. For all that twist and turn. Yeah, the staircase and stuff like that. Because it wasn't meant for living that and we didn't yeah. catch that. So. But it, we got TV and then there is, I said, there is a bathroom in here and a shower. So you get real dirty after hunting. Or fishing or something for the day. Well, you gotta guess, man. God, if somebody, heck, if I get, if I get kicked out, I can. This could be the. I just need your garage. So code. this is the community doghouse. Right. So if I get kicked out, I come here. You get kicked out, you yeah, come yeah, here. Like we can stay. have a party being both in the doghouse. No then. one will know. No. So yeah, we squeezed in a, a, a three-quarter bath. Yep. Sink, and then toilet, Tom, shower. Check this out. We did. Uh, Tom made. This is all the stuff out of my warehouse. The warehouse vanity. Nice. We still have more stuff. Is there really? I think it's just, Oh my I gosh. Think it's growing. But that turned out really cool what Tom came up nice. with. Nice. Yeah, that's good. This weird ceiling, we had to come up with a, a strange mirror that yeah. still, still, still looks good. Yeah, look, I, I like it. It looks awesome. It yeah. fits. Yeah. So, so it, it, I, like, I have used this. If I come in, like sometimes I feel like I walked a bunch of poison ivy, I can come in here and spray off. And if I walk in the mud, I can spray off. And then I can go in the main house without. I'd throw in the dog wash. Right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I have used that. Power wash I've, I, have, I have sprayed off in the dog wash. So we've got a few of our other friends here, oh. like the. That was my first buck I ever shot, so I had to get him mounted. This came out of the backyard of the old house. No kidding. Yeah, right things? in the backyard. And then this was Africa, not the backyard. Wow. So I didn't yeah. realize you've been to Africa and hunted all these yeah. things. Yeah. Here's the hat rack that we, we, we found. We found the hats yesterday. Oh, oh. They were in a box in the shop. Oh, no So kidding. we're going to put the hats on later this week, hopefully, and get all, everything was going. It, was but it labeled? It just said box? It was just a big box, just and it has like 100 hats in it. So <laughs> we'll have to. Oh, so you're asking for jerk. Oh, uh, look. We found it. We have, we have a couple laying around. So what are people saying? Are they liking the... The uh, beef or the beef pork? Beef or the pork is, is most the, people. I think it's probably it's probably like a 70 30. 70 percent think pork is better. 30 percent probably think it's beef is better. Oh no kidding! But there's quite a few people that still think beef is better, yeah. which is surprising. Because I think pork's really good. Industry standard is beef. Beef, yeah. yeah. But I was the majority of people like pork better. But most people like both. I haven't yeah. found, and, it, and it, they're very different. The pork is sweeter, and then the beef is more of like a salty jerky. So if you're like craving beef jerky, go with the beef. But if you want like a really tasty snack. I think the pork's better. Yeah, the bad. pork is so tender and juicy. It's very so, good. No wonder so, it's sold out. That's why. Sold out. Here's Only a few stuff. more packs. Oh, yeah. There's more stuff out of the, 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 the warehouse. This is the warehouse wall? The wall, right in yeah. here as well. And, I thought that uh, turned out good. But we did get shot down by the girls. We wanted to do that wall too. But Yeah, they said too much, which I, I don't disagree. I think this looks, it looks clean in here now. Uh -huh. Well, it's not clean. It's actually really dirty, but... It looks clean as far as aesthetics and stuff. Now, will you move your this kind of operation? This is kind of nice when you're home to work on stuff, but with the new warehouse that yeah. you bought, will you move like your headquarters there? Or, yeah. or do you like working close I mean, to home? I still need a YouTube, like the YouTube stuff to be here because that's where we're doing most of the filming. So we took a lot of the stuff and took it to the warehouse. But I still have my computer where I'll sit and do some edits and stuff like that. Camera gear always stays here. We've got... Just a big table, conference table for us to sit and hang out. Well, but. there's a table that Tom built you. Yeah. That we got all that yep. claim wood. So you're putting it to good use. Yeah, I really like that table. We put outlets in the floor too because we were kind of yep. planning on some desks. So yep. otherwise you got cords behind you running around. So Yeah, no, this worked yeah. out good. It's nice up here. Like I said, it's yeah. kind of nice to have my own little space come up here and do my thing. And can like I told you, it looks like bombs go off. That's what YouTube does. So it's nice to not have this in the house, in the main house. Right. But you can come in this room, shut that door, then yep. you have to hang out. But you're cooking and cleaning and yep. I mean, not, you're you're cooking. Yep. What's that again? You're catching. You're catching. And you're cleaning. And cleaning. Then, then you're, you're cooking. cooking. Yeah, that's it. All exactly. Right. I haven't said that enough <laughs> to get it in order. <laughs> yeah. But so this is a big space. It's huge. You can yeah, you can put a big it. couch in here. Oh, look at yeah. a couple of strays in here. Yeah. They sometimes they just Banjo live. I just catch Jake. them living up here. Wow. Banjo yeah. lives here part time. Yeah. But nobody knows. No one knows. There was supposed to be a cot, and you turn it into a conference. Table. I say that conference table could be swapped out for a bed, and he could Mostly he could live here. Yeah, something hard. You don't like a soft mattress no, anyway. No. no. No, that'll kill your back. Just sleep on the table. Yeah. Exactly. So yeah, it would be nice to get a. I mean, yeah, we'll get a couch. We'll get a couch in here, and I don't know, you you put like, like a little foosball. foosball yeah, I say foosball. Yeah. We're on the same page. I like that. Foosball table would be nice in here. And we'll, then this door real quick, that we gotta get some hardware on. This is like where you, have you got any merch We haven't here? put any merch in yet. Yeah, oh. New merch comes in soon. Because you can't open the door. Can you not open it? Yeah, I, well, I feel well, like. I, you have to come down here. Uh, see, what, there's a little latch right there. So if you can't get Oh, I feel like I've opened these before now. Maybe I have. Good, well, it happens, they get a little dusty. If you put a little Vaseline on them. Like really? But you, you really right can't in. open these? For some reason, yeah. I, th I thought I you opened can, this. But it's like the top, I have to bounce it. We need a, we need a crowbar? Are we getting this on camera? 
I th- we've opened this door before, right? Yeah. Yeah. We've, I said, we've definitely opened it. If it sits there, it's like these little things. Isn't it just get, like a little knob in there? It's a little, yeah, if you just push on it, it'll roll down. It's a little tiny roller. You just, there you go. And you hope the, you, yeah, it'll pull off. Close. Oh, there, there it is. Goes. Hey! See, they do work. See that little, see how it goes down? Oh, I stuck. see. Oh, yeah, they're really stiff. See? Oh, they are. Oh, it's because there's paint oh, on them. That, that's, that's, that's why. why. The painters. Guys, painters. That's the painters, yeah. So yeah, this is. This is the this look, out. look out. <laughs> See, that's why we didn't put the freak there. Wait, we got a bleeder. All right, before we leave, this one one last secret Room. door. Another add-on, another after the fact, another not in the blueprint. Oh, that's all right. You said you looked up and saw in the attic. What's we gonna do with all that space? That was, I think that was on camera when I said that too. Yeah. Like the moment I realized we should do something here was we were filming and I was like, why don't we do something up here? Yeah. And you're like, because it's a ranch and you don't have two stories in ranches. And I was like, well, I still feel like we should do something. Yeah, so we, we did something. Look at all this room. Yeah, so, so this, this is the, this is the storage the room. Plan either. Yeah, so remember the elevator that you guys saw come down earlier? That's where this goes. So when you set stuff on the elevator, you come up, and then you can see this is all the holiday decorations and extra stuff. And then we still have, we still need one more shelf here. Oh, we can make more, but then here's another clip. So you can heat and cool this room. Yes, keep it, keep it at a nice comfortable temperature. Yeah. Really finished as if it's, it's really a finished room. Yeah, you can make because it an office, you can make it whatever you want. Yeah. You've got outlets, you've got it insulated, you got AC, you yeah. got baseboards and flooring. You can see there's part of the rafters, Yeah. part of the trusses. So we're gonna, when Eugenio gets caught up, we'll yeah. bring him in and put some more of that reclaimed wood. Okay, nice, yeah. the warehouse. We gotta burn to, to, that up somewhere. Yeah, that's right. After burn we build the fancy uh, lake cabin this so that, i thought this turned out good since that was supposed to be storage then it turned into man cave we need, still need a place for storage so we just made it happen yeah i think it makes a lot of sense because you bring your stuff into your garage yep. and then you got to carry it through your house down the steps into a storage yeah room. that doesn't make here, sense you sit it on here lift it up and roll it right off. make it easy yeah awesome this, no this room turned out awesome i love it just for the record this lift comes all the way up there you go and then it just easy rolls. to grab your boxes Andrew, that's, your, that's the tour that was a good tour. I really have, one, I want to thank you and Macy for allowing me to be your guide to build your house because yeah. that's a big trust factor. It is It is big trust, but we knew you were, it, same goes for us though. We have to be able to trust somebody and, and we feel like you were easy to work with the whole time. And anytime I wanted to add something, which seemed like about every week, you just said, no problem, we'll figure it out. Yeah, which is nice because now I do have my actual dream house. Well, good. And, and it turned out fantastic. Yeah. I, I, they always turn out, I hope, better than what you had thought in the beginning. Yeah. Oh, it did. So, 100%. Uh, but we still have more projects. I don't want this to be the last one. No, so. I said, I've got a lot more ideas. Do you? Yeah. Well, one, I know you told me about is the lake. Yeah. You want to build a old, rustic kind of looking, what, what are we going to call that? A marina? A, a, little, a little bait shop marina, boathouse, having maybe a catch and cook area where you can clean the fish and maybe cook them like a bar, I'm thinking. Okay. And then you have a slip that you can pull your boat in and that would be covered, which would be kind of cool. And then we'll have like a little miniature tackle shop in there, maybe some minnow tanks. So if anyone wants to go fishing, you have everything you need. Your rods, your reels, your bait. You know, maybe a, a big cooler filled with a bunch of like drinks and stuff. Do I have to buy cool my, my Guggen Squad baits? Or is it, you is you it, do. Is it free? You have to buy it. It's kind okay. Of, I'll get. I'll get. I'll get discount code. Well, give, I'll give you, you know discount what, give code. Give me some coupons. I'm a okay. big coupon guy. Yeah, I'll give you. Never really worked for me. Maybe they might work in your. Yeah, thing. I'll give you some discounts. Well, yeah. Think of, now we got all this land. We're gonna be your neighbor. Yep. We got kids. You have grandkids. You have you know, little Brooklyn. Yeah. We need a tree house. A tree house. We do need a tree. I've always wanted to build like a legit. Legit tree house. I've just never been able to come up with it, but I know you'll you'll come up with something crazy. And we got Eugenio, so he's and we got Eugenio, so we're good to go. Yeah, <laughs> anything's possible with Eugenio. Yeah. Give us some more ideas. I mean, we've got you've, with the land you have. Yeah, we've 50 got some acres. Yep. There's plenty of projects. Zip line. I don't yep. Know if that's legal, and, Z- we'll and, figure out a zip line. Yeah. The zip line's gonna happen. It's gonna have to happen. Yeah. And plenty of ideas. Yeah. Comment down below. We need some ideas. Well, Flair's willing to have fun, and I, one video I want to try to do is see if I can write all your toys in one day. And what, the, ninety percent of them don't operate. They're dead batteries or need like fresh fuel, but I can make it happen. We can make it go. Yeah, up I got I got tune them up. Okay. And then we can we can drive them all maybe in the shop now that's clean. You guys are great at ideas. Give. Flair and I ideas yes. on what you would like to see next because I want to keep doing stuff with Andrew. It's a yeah. lot of fun. And I really appreciate you guys watching. Thanks for letting me be your home builder. Oh, yeah. And we're going to do some more stuff and we're going to have more job sites for you guys to check on. So That's thanks right. for watching.